I'm not, re I'm, re I'm not really good with prayers or anything like that, but I just want to say thank you, Mr. President. And I know we have a political warfare right now, but I strongly believe that it is a spiritual one as well. And I want to make, <laughs> and I want to make sure that, I mean, <clears throat> I know that Americans are going to wake up and we're going to get back to looking to God instead of social media. And we're going to look back to Jesus because Jesus saves. And this country was founded upon, the, the Constitution was built on godly principles. And we're going to fight for that. And I just want to encourage you guys to pray every single day for this nation. I want you guys to pray and pray and pray. Um, I am from Ethiopia. I live in a very beautiful city named Valparaiso, Indiana. Mike sent you. I know you're from Indiana, and I have strong, strong people um, who are able to raise me, and I love God, and I'm, I want to pray <laughs> real quick. All right. Okay. All right. I don't know if you guys want to bow your head. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Dear God, I'm not really good at this, but. Um, I just want to say thank you so much for giving us this opportunity to be in the White House. Thank you for giving us a great leader like Trump, Mr. Donald Trump. And I would like to thank you for um, waking up our nation. God protect us. God protect our president as he's going through so much right now, so much scrutiny. God, I believe that you were, you gave him to us, and I believe that he's going to accomplish so much more. I know you have more for us. Jesus, I ask you to protect us and walk with us. <laughs> um, and in Jesus' name, the enemy tries to attack us every single day. He tries to discourage us, but he has no room. He has no room, no more. And that's all I have to say. <laughs> oh my God.